What's up guys, how's it going? Mike the Tech here, and in this video I'm going to show you how to fix Red Dead Redemption 2 not starting due to the error, GFX init error, and we're going to go ahead and fix that really quickly today with a kind of a shortcut fix. I'll explain what happened and why it's doing this, and then show you how to fix it. Uh, before we get started, if you're watching this video, chances are you're not subscribed because 99% of you are not subscribed. That's a pretty bad number. So if you like this video, be sure to click on that sub or thanks button below. So let's go ahead and jump into the fix itself. What's happening is it's trying to use the Vulkan API, um, which has recently been updated and no longer works with Red Dead Redemption 2 and NVIDIA's drivers. There is an error or an issue with the latest Vulkan API. So you can install the older Vulkan API or the easier method is to simply switch to DirectX 12. And that's pretty much the fastest fix. Um, if you'd like me to make a video on installing the new Vulkan API or downgrading to an older Vulkan API that would work with this, I can also do that. Um, but I think switching to DirectX will keep you using the latest and greatest in tech instead of having to downgrade to an older version. Um, so let's go ahead and jump right into the fix. Go ahead and go to your file explorer, go to your documents, scroll all the way down to Rockstar Games, and then go to Red Dead Redemption 2, and go to Settings, and then scroll down to System. All right, and go ahead and edit system.xml. You can do this in Notepad or uh, Visual VS Code or whatever you want to edit in, and you're going to scroll down until you see uh, Advanced Graphics API Case Setting API Vulkan. And you're going to change Vulkan to DX12. That's it. And hit save. Close this. And we're going to try launching the game again and seeing if it works. Let's go ahead and hit play. And it opens the launcher. There it is. The game has launched and it's working properly. Uh, so yeah, let me know if you have any questions in the comment section below and thank you so much for watching. Peace. Conversations to games to interviews with a broader view. He keeps it fresh, always brings something new. It's Mike the Tech, Mike the Tech, huh? Mike the Tech, the architect, huh? Mike the Tech, Mike the Tech, yeah. Mike the Tech, the architect, huh? 